Funny Cave. Seven times the Simpsons predicted the future. Number seven, the Rolling Stones tour. In the 1995 Simpsons episode called Lisa's Wedding, a dorm room had a Rolling Stones poster for their 2010 wheelchair tour. And now in 2016, the Rolling Stones are still touring, but still not in wheelchairs. Number six, Tiger Attack. In 1993, the magical duo of Gunter and Ernst were attacked by one of their white tigers during a performance. Ten years later, in 2003, a seven-year-old white tiger attacked magician Roy Horn of Siegfried and Roy during a performance on the Las Vegas Strip. Roy was critically injured and sustained severe blood loss. The attack occurred on Roy's 59th birthday. Number five, the baby translator. In 1992, Homer's half brother invented a device to translate what your baby is saying, and in 2015, the Infant Cries Translator app was released. And this app can tell you if your baby is crying because they're hungry, tired, or in pain. Researchers collected 200,000 crying sounds from 100 newborn babies to create the software. The app is said to be 92% accurate in infants under two weeks and 85% accurate in infants under two months. Number four, chocolate-covered bacon. In 2003, Homer prays for a new kind of snack, and Homer's prayer causes an accident between a bacon truck and a fudge truck, resulting in bacon fudge. And just two years later, chocolate-covered bacon was available in stores. And this is reason number twenty-seven on why the terrorists hate us. Number three, President Donald Trump. In a March two thousand episode of The Simpsons, Bart Simpson gets a look into his future. Yes, all the way to the year two thousand. His sister Lisa is president of the United States, and the country is broke as a result of a disastrous Donald Trump presidency. Now this might not qualify as a prediction because this episode aired after Donald Trump had already explored running for president back in 2000. But fast forward to 2016, and there's a decent chance Donald Trump could be elected president. So do you think Donald Trump would make a good president? Go ahead and have an angry debate in the comments section. And speaking of the comments section, be sure to check out the end of the video where I have some advice for you about writing comments. Number two, chocolate theme park. In 1991, during a meeting, Homer dreamed of the land of chocolate. And in 2010, a chocolate theme park called World Chocolate Wonderland in Shanghai, China, opened for business. The park contains a replica of the famous Terracotta Army, 500 life-size figures, as well as a BMW made from two tons of chocolate. The park also advertises that it has the world's biggest chocolate model of the Great Wall of China. But then again, it's easy to say that you have the world's biggest chocolate model of the Great Wall of China when nobody else in the world has a chocolate model of the Great Wall of China. I mean, there's no competition. Now, before I get to number one, I just want to say something. I'm at 35,000 subscribers now, so I want to thank each and every one of you so much for subscribing. I really appreciate it. And I also want to thank you for all the nice comments I've gotten. But you know, every once in a while, I'll get some nasty comments on my videos. But usually, the nasty comments are not really that interesting. So I wanted to help out people who would like to leave a negative comment, but they don't know what to say. So what you could say is something like, "Hey, Funny Cave, did the Simpsons predict that you would make this crappy video?" Or how about,、uh, "Hey, hey, Funny Cave, watching your videos is just like watching The Simpsons, seasons 21 to 26, that is." But anyway, I hope you choose to leave a nice comment instead of a nasty one. Okay, back to the list. Number one on the list of things predicted by The Simpsons is the 9/11 terrorist attacks. In one episode of The Simpsons, the family went to New York City, and in one scene, the cover of a magazine shows the word New York, and the twin towers, and nine dollars. The nine and the twin towers combine to look like 9/11. And this episode aired in 1997, four years before Islamic extremists attacked the World Trade Center. But of course, after 27 years, the Simpsons have basically done everything. So there's bound to be some things that they did that sound like amazing predictions. Anyway, thanks for watching, and if you like this video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you didn't like this video, just go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Bye for now.